If you are a parent, you know all about the terrible twos, but a toddler in Harbor Township put a new spin on it today during some horseplay with the family cats. Don Cannon is live now in our newsroom with a story you'll see only here on KDKA. Don. Yeah, thank you, Jess. Dr. Seuss wrote all about the cat in the hat, but I bet he never thought about the kid in the event. That story played out today in Harbor Township. And like Dr. Seuss, this story has a happy ending. She's in there. Get out of there. She says that's danger. Boy, is it ever dangerous. And little Hannah Schoon found that out the hard way. Mommy, mommy. Hannah put a new spin on the terrible twos when she became trapped in a heating vent at the family home in Harmer Township. She says, Mommy, stuck. Mommy, stuck. Mommy, stuck. Little Hannah was playing with one of the family's five cats when she climbed into the heat vent and couldn't climb back out. Her upper body stuck in the bedroom, her legs dangling into the basement below. She opens the vent for them to go into, yeah. and it's a game. Yeah. It's a game, a game that resulted in her actually thinking that she was a cat and went down in there after them. So what happened early this morning when Mommy wasn't looking, little Hannah came over here where the cats play and decided to sit in the vent return. Hannah was halfway in and halfway out, and Mom was halfway frantic. Screaming and crying and carrying on, I handed her some books to look at, because uh, you know, at this point I didn't know if her legs were hurt. Eventually, Harmer police and paramedics pulled Hannah free. She suffered just a few scratches on her left leg, but otherwise she's okay. In fact, she learned a new word today. She knows what stuck means now. Mary Ann Schoon says she's planning to secure those heating vents in the house just in case little Hannah tries to play Chase the Cats again. In the newsroom, I'm Don Cannon, KDK-TV News. Thanks, Don. What a cute little girl. More news of the day and AccuWeather straight ahead. KDK-TV News at 6 starts.